Good afternoon, everyone, and thanks for tuning into this um, episode from the series, my first month at Aguas Bio. So I'm here with Wilf Keller, who is the CEO and president of this company. And a cool fact about Wilf is that he actually just got inducted into the Canadian Agriculture Hall of Fame. So you want to talk about that a little bit? Well, I, this was a, a great surprise to me to, to receive this news of, about uh, being inducted into the Canadian Agricultural Hall of Fame. Uh, the reason I, I, it was a surprise is that in our business, we're used to working in teams. Mm. And a lot of the, the results that come out of work are the result of teamwork. So hmm. yeah. uh, I think that it's uh, an honor for me to really represent a team. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, that's a wonderful way you put it. And definitely feels like a team at this company. Well, you know, I worked many years in research. I was particularly working with canola and improving canola as a crop. And I had the opportunity to work as a scientist and as a manager in the federal government in Agriculture Canada in Ottawa hmm. for 17 years, wow. the National Research Council on Saskatoon for 18 years. Wow. Hmm. So I'm actually a retired scientist. <laughs> wow. I then moved on to Genome Prairie where we did a lot of uh, support work in the genomics area. area. Hmm. And, and in 2012, I had a chance to join Ag West, and I did. Hmm. And my many years of experience <laughs> helped me with connections, knowing yeah. people, knowing our government systems, funding systems. Systems yeah. to try and support what we do in Ag West. Wow. And my job at Ag West may be <laughs> the best job I've had in my career because <laughs> wow. we have a fairly small team that works hard. Mm. It's about passion to do mm. something. And mm. agriculture and, and food are so important in, in society at yes. our local level, national and a global level. Yes. And there's a lot we need to do to make mm. sure we have sustainable production, mm. that we are environmentally friendly, mm. that we kind of that we produce the feed and the food products that we need to sustain a growing population in yes. a healthy lifestyle. Mm. So uh, Saskatchewan mm. has 40 some percent, about 42 percent of Canada's arable land. So those yeah. of us here in Saskatchewan yeah. have an opportunity to build an agri-food industry and a sector that goes beyond just Saskatoon or Saskatchewan, but in fact has global uh, results because we can be a net food exporter. Well, science since the very beginning has been critical to build agricultural production to help with human health mm. and to move society forward. Yeah. And in many ways, we're just scratching the surface. We're mm. learning more about genetics, mm. about how plants grow, how they reproduce, how yeah. we can maintain the health of our soil, mm. how we can use all the microorganisms that are in the soil and the environment to not only improve nutrition but to improve mm. environmental quality right. those are just a few examples of what we can do to address uh, the challenges we have out there in terms of the need to produce for mm -hmm. a growing population yeah. dealing with issues around climate uh, changes that might be happening over the foreseeable future mm -hmm. uh, recognizing mm -hmm. that we want to have clean production uh, that there is a desire to produce to consume more vegetable protein. Yes. All of those are challenges and opportunities for mm -hmm. us to address. So you, you can only do that through scientific principles and scientific discovery. Mm -hmm. We know, for example, the functionality of plant proteins and how mm -hmm. they can be used in human food to produce better products. There's yeah. research there, for example. Yeah. Thanks for tuning in to another episode from the series My First Month at Ag West Bio. For more videos like this one, please subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button below. You can also check out our website at agwest.sk.ca and follow us on social media on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time.